Hello and welcome to the Nathan Markley Show. And now your host, Nathan Markley. Well, hello folks and welcome to another episode of the Nathan Markley Show. This is episode 22. I'm your host, Nathan Markley. Alright, so it's been a while since I've uploaded an uh, episode. I know the last time I uploaded was um, in May, and it is June. And I know I said I was going to upload two episodes a week, but I've been busy. But hopefully now I am looking at my whiteboard here where I have written down everything that I have to do. And one of the things I written down was to do a episode of the Nathan Markley Show every week about Mondays, record both of them, and then upload it Wednesdays and Saturdays before 8 p.m. or at 8 p.m. because that's when the show starts. Uh, I want to thank you all for listening and downloading my podcast. I've seen a lot of downloads I've also seen a lot more comments and shares, which is pretty awesome. So thank you for that. And all right. So I want to talk a little bit about my videos. So for those of you who've been following me on YouTube for the past six years now, you know that I make a video blog, video diary of my life. I call it documentary through my 20s, I say. It's called The Life of Nathan Markley. And lately, I haven't been filming because there's no really nothing I want to document. Nothing really changes. And I'm trying to figure out a new way to do this. And I think I've came to a conclusion. If you watched two, three videos I uploaded to my YouTube channel in the past two weeks, I think. I don't remember when I uploaded it. You know this already. I am going to try something new. I'm going to try to upload the video to Facebook because Facebook video has become more and more popular these days. And ever since Facebook released Facebook Live to everyone, Android and iOS users, I've been seeing more and more people using Facebook Live, including myself. Uh, if you follow me on Facebook, you can see me live stream my walkouts. So that would be pretty cool. If you, if you want to know what I do for walking out, that will be something you might want to check out. Follow me on Facebook and... When I go live, you get a notification that I have. Go live at the gym. So, saying that, I want to try something, an experiment. There's no really anyone out there doing this daily vlogs that people are doing on YouTube on Facebook. So, I'm going to be trying it out and see how it works. Because with Facebook's policy and algorithm, they kind of put videos up for us on newsfeed. And also, on mobile, Facebook uh, auto-plays the video so people will see it. So, I can get quick views that way and more and more people could probably watch it. Hopefully, that's the plan. I'm not sure if I'm going to upload these videos to YouTube when I'm uploading them to Facebook. I have uploaded videos to Facebook that I've already uploaded to uh, YouTube. But I, I, I'm not... So basically what I'm saying is I'm not sure if I want to continue doing YouTube and just try a different platform. Uh, I like YouTube as much. It got me started in this content creation. It showed me that what I really love to do is making content, being a audio video production or video producer. 
also uh, doing a podcast. That's another content. So, in the video I uploaded a couple weeks ago, I said that I'm going to change the life of Nathan Mockley from a daily video to a a once-a-week video series. Kind of a TV show. That's what I'm calling it. I'm creating my own TV show. And so beyond the television, it's going to, well, okay. Instead of being on cable TV, it's going to be on the internet. And the reason I say cable TV is because now TVs are really just monitors with built-in computers with the internet. Actually, they're not really computers. They're just monitors with built-in uh, network cards, Wi-Fi or Ethernet. And it can connect it to your internet, your Wi-Fi hotspot, or plug it through the Ethernet. Most of it's Wi-Fi. Most of it's Wi-Fi. And get internet. And go on YouTube, go on Facebook, go on whatever, other Hulu, Netflix, whatever you watch for videos. So, uh, it, it kind of will be, so it is real that TV is. So you could watch my series, The Life of Nathan Markley, on TV, the internet. I just said nowadays, you, watch it, you can watch it nowadays. So, what... That means is I'm going to create my own TV show and upload it once a week. I'm going to try filming like every day, then edit the footage, and then releasing it out. And for the month of June, I'm going to upload it for us on Facebook, promote it via Facebook, and see how that goes. Now... I've been reading a lot and doing research about Facebook versus YouTube, and they both have the pros, they both have the cons. And yes, I know YouTube is number two in the search engine, and a lot of people use YouTube to search videos and watch that. But I feel like Facebook, because they have the news feed and everyone's always checking the news feed, everyone's always on Facebook, as I see, uh... I think I can get better engagement on there. So, like I said a few minutes ago, I'm not sure if I'm going to upload these videos for the month of June on YouTube and Facebook or just Facebook. And then if I don't like what how Facebook is doing with the engagement, switch it back over to YouTube. We'll see. Uh, I'll let you guys know. I'll keep you updated on this whole process. Uh, to continue watching me right now, a link in the show notes in the description will be my Facebook profile. Actually, it's not going to be on my profile. It's going to be on my Facebook page. I've created a business page called NathanMarkley.net. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I've created a business, a brand on uh, NathanMarkley.net, and that's where I'm going to be posting a lot more stuff, and that's where the videos are going to be hosted right now on Facebook, and I'm, I'm just going to share it through my profile. So, uh, because I think what I'm going to end up doing is everything I do, all the content I make online is going to be hosted in the NathanMarkley.net family and really make it into a business. Because as I'm looking at the whiteboard, I will, you should see this whiteboard. I have like so many stuff written down. It's like filled up. I can't even write more stuff. Uh, everything I want to do, it kind of relates all over to the brand. And I do have a couple of things I'm working on that I don't, I can't release just yet. I can't say. Until I get it finished. But, yeah. All oh, good stuff coming. And now that since I graduated CCRI with my associate's degree. Oh, yeah, that's right. I haven't told you guys this. For those of you who just listen to this podcast and don't follow me on social media, what are you guys doing? You should follow me on social media and you should follow me on YouTube. Because there's a video that's saying I graduated CCRI. I actually filmed my CCRI graduation. I graduated college with my associate's degree, uh, associate's in science and computer studies with a concentration in networking. So now since that's completed, uh, 
I'm have some more time to do what I want to do with the brand and create the business and have some ideas. I also, the plan is to continue my education and go to four-year college for my Bachelor's of Science in Cybersecurity. I don't know. Truthfully, I don't know. I, I, I'm having second thoughts about that, and I really like doing what I'm doing, and I really don't need a college degree to do what I want to do, what I love to do. But we'll see. So, yeah, that gives you three updates. Uh, well, two updates, actually. The, well, yeah, three updates, because I told you about YouTube, how I'm trying to figure out if I really should do YouTube and Facebook, the Nathan Markley, the life, the life of Nathan Markley TV show would be hosted on Facebook right now. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to post it on YouTube or not. And the brand, NathanMarkley.net, and a lot more stuff is going to be coming on that. The Nathan Markley show still going to be separate from NathanMarkley.net, but I'm still going to promote it via NathanMarkley.net. And I graduated CCOI. So, yeah. Also, I haven't mentioned this, but back in February of this year, 2016, I've started another podcast. You, If you follow me on Facebook and Twitter, you already know this. But if not, again, link below in the show notes description. The podcast I started is with my friend, and it's called the Aubrey and Nathan Podcast. And what that is, me and him, we talk about technology, politics, uh, programming, other geek stuff, and pretty much what we decided to do was record our conversations and make it a podcast. Because a little story on that, backstory, is we'll be talking, and we do a lot of Google Hangouts and Skype, and we'll be, t- we'll be talking on the phone, and the stuff we talk about, conversations about like, technology news, and new program and stuff, or politics, we end up saying, we should record that, we should make a podcast, and it'll be, pr- that'll be a perfect podcast topic. And so we just one day decided to turn on the recorder on our, my computer and start recording the conversation. And it's gotten a lot of hits. So I'll leave the link below to that podcast. You can download it on iTunes. You can download it on Facebook. Uh, yeah. Actually, yeah, you can listen to a Facebook. You can download a Google Play or any other podcast app that you use to listen to podcasts. Pretty much. It's called The Aubrey and Nathan Podcast. Uh, the website is The Aubrey and Nathan Podcast at Lipson.com. I'll leave a link to the website, a Facebook page, and the iTunes link uh, below in the show notes so you guys can check that out. And yeah, so you listen to the podcast, you can, you can listen to that I co host and produce. Uh, co-executive producer and co-host is that titles. Yeah. Uh, update on working out. That's the next thing on my list on the uh, whiteboard. I bought a lot of supplements. Oh, that was weird. Oh, sorry about that. I bought a lot of supplements. Uh, I bought pro- new protein powder. Vanilla ice cream, which is pretty good. I bought my vitamins, my fish oil, which is two supplements I think everyone, no matter if you try to lose weight or be a bodybuilder or physique competitor, walking out, you should take a multivitamin and fish oil because you can't get the necessary nutrients and stuff you need to be healthy, to live a healthy lifestyle. So I got those. I got a CLA to help with fat loss and the other benefits of that. L-carnitine, which is another fat loss supplement that kind of pretty much what it does, it transfers fat to your muscles to be born. Uh, it does other scientific stuff, but uh, pretty much for use, it helps with fat loss. 
I bought raspberry keto keto. Yeah, keto. That's another fat loss thing. Uh that somewhat works. I think it's keto. This is called keto diet. And I also have ZMA. And uh I think that's it. Oh. One more. Hold on. What was the other one? We had the protein, we had the multivitamin, we had the fish soy, we had the CLA, we had the L-carnitine, with the raspberry keto, we had the ZMA, and the testosterone booster. All that I help build muscle, and that also does a little bit of fat loss too with the diet. But because I've taken all the supplements, I the reason I'm taking all these supplements, as I say, is because I've been lifting heavy and really walking out a lot. And <clears throat> I've been trying to track my macros. And because the nutrition, nutrition, is, nutrition, is, nutrition is a little low for what I'm doing, trying to like cut, uh, I need the supplements to back up to get those um stuff, you know, because uh, a supplement is just what it, it, it is what it is, it's a supplement, it's to help you to supplement stuff with nutrition, so, yeah, uh, speaking of nutrition, like I said, I'm trying to track my macros, uh, I noticed that at night I get really hungry, so I'm trying to fix that by eating my meals during the day and afternoon, and have a light snack, um, of course, healthy at night. Uh, some days it works, some days it doesn't. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm really trying to get, <sighs> trying to get that nutrition down pack plan. I really need to. <laughs> I always say this. I hate prepping my meals. I need to find someone to just prep my meals for me. Uh, I wish I had the money to just hire myself a chef and prep all my meals. It'd be so much easier. <sighs> oh well, that's one of the things you have to do when you uh, prep to be a uh, bodybuilder, men's physique competitor. Oh yeah, you got you don't know that. Uh, I posted on Facebook, I'm going to be competing in two competitions, stepping the stage in the fall of 2016, October, November. One is WBFF, Transformation Challenge, and the other one's NPC, Men's Physique. I think that's going to be an open C. And after those two, I'll see how I feel and how I did. I'll evaluate, evaluate, yeah. Evaluate everything, and I might continue doing physique competitions or just become a bodybuilder, meaning walking up to build muscle, so bring my weight back up. So right now I'm dropping the weight to at least a 180, one, yeah, 180, and I want my uh, body fat to be like 8-6% when I step on stage, which is doable. And then, if I become a bodybuilder, I'll bring it back up to 290 or so with all the muscle weight, but still be a low body fat percentage. And, uh, yeah, that's the plan. I, I'm thinking about creating bodybuilding into another career of mine, like a full-time job, which would be uh, very interesting to see how I do. But, yeah. All right. I want to talk about what I'm recording this podcast on today. So, a little while back, about the summer 2015, I bought a digital recorder called Tascam DR40. And I used that to record a podcast before. I don't remember my episode. And it, it's really good. I actually bought it for my video camera, video camera, my DSLR, to take audio. Then I got the uh, Rode Video Mic Go which is a little better. So now I use this just to record audio. And 
because this the task cam does record audio pretty well. And I can use the internal microphones to different positions. But I'm I have a external microphone plugged in. I got this at Radio Shack. I think it's called a dynamic mic. And it's one of those microphones you see like on live performances or on stage, you know. And it sounds pretty good. It's recording through that line one, and it's recording in mono. I did mono because then I can export it out to stereo. And because there's only one line, I just do uh, mono. I'm still learning about this task cam. Like, there's a couple of features that I don't know, like a four channel and a dual mode. I wonder if that's for something to do with like recording over the um, files. But yeah, uh, let me know what you think of the sound. I'm pretty sure you can't hear my air conditioner. Hopefully, you can't. But, I mean, it seems like it's doing pretty good. It tells me this, uh, how far I'm going. Because right now it's at 21 minutes. And the level, every time I talk, it's pretty good. But I realize it does when I'm peaking. So if I talk a little louder or I go up close to the microphone, it peaks. So I'll try not to do that. And when I'm not talking, the meter, level meter, goes down. And it doesn't... It doesn't pick up the air conditioner or any background noise. So that's pretty cool. I like this setup. If I like the audio quality, I might use this setup more and more when I'm outside now that it's summertime and I like spending spending time out in the outdoors. Which just gave me an awesome idea. Because I do want to go camping this summer again. And it be an awesome podcast. Huh. Anyways, uh, I think that's it for episode 22 for this episode of the Nathan Markley Show. The next episode, I think I'll talk a little bit less about me and update and more about technology because I haven't talked about technology lately. And I am doing some research about something. I don't want to say what. It seems pretty interesting. So, I'm going to go uh, to end the show. I want to thank you all for listening. And don't forget that you can download this podcast on iTunes, on Google Play, on my website, The Nathan Markley Show, on my Facebook page. You can listen to it. And please do me a favor and leave me a review on iTunes. And let me know what you think of the show. Comment. You know, I do read the reviews. I do read the reviews. You can also comment on my website if you listen on there. Uh, It's thenathanmarkleyshow.lipson.com. And check out all the links in the show notes description. And I think that's it. So, peace, good night, don't the bed bugs bite. Bye, guys.